Uh, what we're going to do now um, is honor the first responders in our community. And let me start off by saying Middle Church was a first responder. Um, hundreds and hundreds of people walked by this place, came in these doors. You made that happen. Opened the doors so people could come, have a drink of water, wash their face, sit down and eat, uh, chill for a while. You did that. But we have first responders in our family. Joey Morelli, please come. <coughs> here? Come on. <laughs> Joey was on, on site on 9-11, taking her team in, taking his team in, also setting up crisis centers, counseling centers, and working also at the morgue. Um, that, that was not easy duty, but Joey did that with love. Gloria Moy is here. <laughs> Gloria Moy was at, working at Beth Israel on the 11th, and on the 12th was downtown at Ground Zero working with physicians cleaning the dust out of their eyes, bringing them water, comforting them while they comforted others. Were any of the rest of you working on 9-11? Anybody lost loved ones on 9-11? Please come. Please come and stand in. Please come and stand up for those we've lost, for those who are still struggling with health problems because of the work they've done. And let us stand and, and all of us pray because again, you were first responders to Middle Church. So if you're able, please stand and we'll say a prayer. God of every good gift, of love that's beyond our imaginations. Our hearts will always reverberate for this loss. I want to thank you on behalf of our whole community for the incredible service of Joey Morelli and Gloria Moy mm -hmm. and the firefighters and the police officers and the transit authority officers and the nurses and the clergy and the doctors and the volunteers who showed up and showed out what love looks like. Thank you for courage and faithfulness. And for every life lost, loved ones and family and friends and colleagues, for people of every faith and every religion and every walk of life who perished, we hold a candle in our heart for them, for all of those lost in the subsequent war against terror. We hold a candle for them. We hold a candle for everyone bullied and mistreated because of these tragedies. And we call, hold a candle for ourselves, Lord, that you would make us light, that you would keep us light, that you would help us to forgive those who trespass against us, that we might live lives of love. This we ask in your powerful and majestic name. Amen.